call this meeting to order. Please join me with the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Item number three is to approve today's agenda. Mr. Chairman, I'll move item three. Second. Motion and a second. Any questions or comments? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? Item three carries. Item four is to approve the August 20th, 2019 meeting minutes. So moved. Seconded. Questions or comments? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? Item four carries. Item five is to approve drainage claims. We have none. <laughs> Item six is to accept and place on file the resignation of Levi Prime, correction officer full time, effective August 21st, 2019, per the recommendation of Steve Elifritz, jail administrator. Mr. Chairman, I move item six. Second. Questions or comments? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? Item six carries. Item seven is to approve and authorize Steve Elifritz to jail administrator to fill the vacancy in the jail due to the resignation of Levi Prime. Make the motion to move item seven. A second. Motion and second on item seven. Questions or comments? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? Item seven carries. Item eight is to accept and authorize the hiring of Emily Degner, corrections officer, effective August. 28, 2019, at an hourly rate of 1632 per the recommendation of Steve Elifritz, jail administrator. Mr. Chairman, I'll move item eight. Second. Motion to add a second. Any questions or comments on item number eight? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? Item eight carries. Item nine is to accept and authorize the hiring of Madeline Richardson, corrections officer, effective August 28th. 2019 at an hourly rate of 1632 per the recommendation of Steve Elifritz, jail administrator. Mr. Chairman, I motion to move item 9. Second. Motion to add a second. Questions or comments? All in favor say aye. Aye. Opposed? <coughs> item 9 carries. Item 10 is to accept and authorize a status change from part time to full time for Brody Goodman, corrections officer, effective September 2nd. 2019, per the recommendation of Steve Elifritz, jail administrator. Mr. Chairman, I move item 10. Second. Motion to add a second on item number 10. Any questions or comments? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? Item 10 carries. Item 11 is to accept and authorize a status change from part time to full time for Crystal Vice, corrections officer, effective September 2nd, 2019 per the recommendation of Steve Elifritz, jail administrator. Make the motion to move item 11. Second. Motion to add a second on item number 11. Any questions or comments? All in favor say aye. 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 Opposed? Item 11 passes. Item 12 is to receive and place on file the annual salary step increase for corrections officer Ashley Kepper from 1680 to 1740 per hour, effective September 15, 2019, upon the recommendation of Steve Elifritz, jail administrator, and in accordance with the labor agreement. Mr. Chairman, I'll move item 12. Second. Motion to add a second. Any questions or comments on item number 12? All in favor? Aye. Opposed? Item 12 carries. Item 13 is to receive and place on file the six month salary step increase for corrections officer Anthony Valetti from 1632 to 1680 per hour, effective September 7, 2019, upon the recommendation of Steve Elifritz, jail administrator and in accordance with the labor agreement. Mr. Chairman, I motion to move item 13. Second. Motion and a second. Questions or comments? All in favor say aye. 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 Opposed? Item 13 carries. Item 14 is to receive and place on file a six month salary step increase for corrections officer Camden Kramer from 1632 to 1680 per hour, effective September 28, 2019, upon the recommendation of Steve Elifritz, jail administrator, and in accordance with the labor agreement. Mr. Chairman, I move item 14. Second. 
Chair Member Bennett, 14. A second. Motion and second for item number 14. Any questions or comments? All in favor say aye. 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 Opposed? The motion carries. Item 15 is to receive and place on file the six month salary step increase for Corrections Officer Brody Goodman from 1632 to 1680 per hour, effective September 13, 2019, upon the recommendation of Steve Elbritz, jail administrator, and in accordance with the labor agreement. I'll make the motion to move item 15. I'll second. Motion to add a second. Questions or comments? All in favor say aye. 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 Opposed? Item 15 carries. Item number 16 is to receive and place on file a five-year salary step increase for Clerk Treasurer's Office, Jesse Albright, from 2066 to 2098 per hour, effective September 29, 2019, upon the recommendation of Brenda Engstrom, County Treasurer, and in accordance with the Labor Agreement. Mr. Chairman, I'll move item 16. Second. Motion to add a second on item number 16. Any questions or comments? All in favor say aye. 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 Opposed? The motion carries. Item 17 is to receive and place on file annual manure management plans for lower site at 3407 Signori Avenue, Lowerville, West Roland Park, Fork at 1236 290th Street Calendar, Carl Sanger, 3146 Easter Avenue Calendar. Mr. Chairman, I motion to move item 17. I'll second. Motion and a second. Questions or comments on item number 17? Yeah, on the lower side, he updated his soil samples and he used the Iowa Phosphorus Index to check that box. On the west road in Fork, he added acres, changed crop filtration, used manure analysis, and then Carl Sandgren, he checked existing opportunity, existing operation and not the same plan. Thank you. Any other questions or comments? If none, all in favor say aye. Aye. Opposed? Item 17 carries. Item number 18 is to approve and authorize the chairman to sign the interlocal agreement between the City of Fort Dodge and Webster County for the 2019 Burn Justice Assistant Grant, better known as JAG, and Program Award. Mr. Chairman, I'll move item 18. I'll second. Motion and second on item number 18. Questions or comments? <laughs> Chair, does anyone want to place? Well, it's just, you know, Roger has it, but it's the same agreement we've done every year on this grant. Because the grant is split 50 50 between the city of Fort Dodge and the Western County. Last year we received 10,000 some, and this year the grant's reduced to 18 7, I think. All right. Thank you. All in favor? Aye. 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 Opposed? Item 18 carries. It is now the citizen's opportunity to address this board with items not on the agenda. Board of Supervisor Committee reports. I attended ISAC last week with a couple other board members at some really good meetings. <coughs> I also attended ISAC. It was good conversations all week. Um, Midas is tomorrow, and the CSS Quadrant meeting is tomorrow. I have general detention on Friday over in Eldora because I decided to stay back. I got to go on the Michael Devine show. Wow. Thank you. Thank you for your service. It's great. <laughs> we were at ISAC last week. We have CSS jointly tomorrow, landfill tonight, public health on Thursday, and <coughs> on the weekend is State Rodeo, where everybody can get out and attend it. It's one of the largest tourist attractions in Webster County, and we hope to see you all there. Please remember some of the roads will be closed uh, for the parade and some um, detours in place. You want to give an update on the, uh, black, the road going up by Roger so people know what the Sure. Um, yeah, they're finishing up the uh, base layer paving today. And uh, we've got two more layers in the intermediate and the surface. And those will each take about five working days. And then after that, a few days for painting and shouldering. So right now we're looking around September 20th to have that project complete. All right, motion to adjourn. So, second. All in favor? 